happy to come out with the win, playing a two-hour and 15-minute game. Um, glad everybody's still standing, but uh, just a, a real good fight by the team. You know, Lauren uh, woke up last night with um, strep, or really fever and all that and so she tried to go today and just could not do it so just really proud of the girls we had it even a shorter bench and but there was just a real fight about them they stayed together the whole time and really came out with a strong win faith has the opening bucket and the last bucket in between it wasn't that easy but <laughs> how fitting i guess was that on her senior night for her to kind of put the exclamation point on this one yeah i didn't think about the last one but the first one i was just like it's 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 supposed to happen that way. And uh, again, uh, just I thought everybody came out. Michaela had great, some great numbers tonight and um, just felt like we got in a rhythm at times and we got away from it and got in a rhythm. We didn't shoot particularly well early on, um, but we really came down strong, hit some free throws down the stretch that were really important. We finally start getting to the basket and getting fouled. Um, so I, I, the, really proud of the girls to taking the game plan at halftime and just talking about what we really need to do to get to the line. They did that, knocked down free throws, and that really pushed the edge. Michaela, after that last Carolina layup, it was a two-point game. Did you take the ball out of bounds planning to throw the ball long to Faith? or did you see <laughs> uh, Got the ball in bounds, and I looked uh, up, and Faith was wide open. Uh, I didn't think she would be that wide open, um, but she had a clear path, and I gave the ball up to her, knowing that she would make the easy layup. So uh, I was just surprised that they didn't match up with her quick enough. Faith, how, how much of a grind was today uh, with all the emotions being your last game, but also it wasn't your best shooting performance and you had to kind of stick with it. It was a game of ups and downs. How would you kind of describe, I guess, your last 40 minutes here? Um, I guess a lot going on. Um, just like offensively, uh, I thought there were times where um, it was stagnant. Um, North Carolina, they had their runs, we had our runs, and um, you know it was a game that we just kind of had to keep grinding. And um, towards the end, we were able to do some good things and get the win. And there was a part in the third quarter, you had an eight point lead and mm -hmm. they came back. You had Faith out, was that one of those, you, you give her a few minutes here or there to yeah, you know, we JB was playing well, so we were just trying to play with the lineup a little bit. I don't think there was any rhyme or reason to it, you know, just kind of go on feel and who was shooting the ball well or who was defending. So, um, you know, Faith, uh, I don't know what happened at that particular time, but um, just, just trying to get her rotations right. Um, I thought the end, the, the, the group finished strong down the stretch, so I don't think there was any rhyme or reason to it. It was just like a feel of the game. I feel like you got beat up pretty good today, too. What was that? How physical was it out there? Was it frustrating at times? I know the officiating wasn't always very consistent. Um, it definitely was a grind. Um, can't worry about the officials. Um, they're going to make their calls. But we just continued to play our game and attacking them. And we got to the free throw line and um, put them in. So we just had to have that mindset of not giving up. And we can't worry about the, the officials. Faith, uh, one of the games you missed when you were out was the Virginia Tech game here. <laughs> What do you remember about watching that game, and are you eager to get a chance to play against them in the final regular season game? Yeah, I mean, it's going to be my last Virginia Tech-Virginia game, so I want to make the most of it. Um, I saw that Virginia Tech, they had a great point guard that um, just kind of attacked the rim and um, really got that uh, her teammates open. So I think it's going to be a good defensive game um, on Sunday. Joanne, along those lines, how much better do you feel going into that, mm -hmm. even though it's on the road, knowing you have Faith back? Yeah, and Lauren. <laughs> Hopefully, yeah, I mean, I think she'll be fine but by then. But yeah, it means back to having a full squad and just a regular rotation helps us being able to just give people a little bit of rest here and there. Um, and just, you know, there's the flow. I mean, you know, Faith brings a lot to the table defensively, offensively. I mean, she's just, again, tonight she had a rough shooting night. But again, I, I think it just, we have a better rotation of guards when we have just that extra person. And she's played them. Um, what two eight times since she's been here whatever the number is so she's familiar with them and um and we, it's going to be a defensive grind i mean they're they're a very good defensive team it's always low scoring when you play them so we're going to need everything we, we we can bring on sunday that was a career high for jb at least yeah. at virginia what what did she do tonight that maybe she had not been doing she, I thought she rebounded the ball. I mean, uh, I, we had seven, Aaliyah, Jakira, and Faith all had seven rebounds. I thought she really rebounded the ball. She kept balls alive for us. She obviously shot, shot it well. I thought she took timely shots. I thought she took fairly good shots. Um, so again, she was a spark, but a uh, thing we've been on JB a lot about was her rebounding. I thought she, she did a good job with that. And she was solid defensively. Carolina isn't exactly 
I guess, Notre Dame in terms of length? Yeah. Did you think that, you know, with Lauren and her condition, you have to go really, really small? Confident, did you like that lineup then against them? You still like the matchup? Yeah. You know, we've been playing Ali at the four probably the last three or four games, spurts here and there, and it's been effective for us in different different situations. So it's a it's a nice um, it's nice to have in our back pocket if we need it, you know, depending on what team we're playing. So it is helpful for us, and um, we used it in spurts tonight. Caleb, what did you like about that lineup? I know it's kind of a – bit of a different look and using Aaliyah kind of there at that four and it matched up against Carolina maybe more than, more than other teams. Um, I really like the lineup. Uh, of course, Lauren is a, a key uh, player for us, but um, Aaliyah spreads the floor for us and can attack and um, create opportunities for all of us. So I think that's a great look for us. And um, But we always have that traditional post matchup that we can take advantage of. Yeah, Joanne, on the other side, how big of an absence was her, though, when you look down at the points in the paint uh, yeah. situation? Yeah, I know, 38 to 16. Yeah, it was tough. I mean, she she tried to go, but, you know, like I said, she had 102 fever this morning, and it um, she just looked awful. So she tried, and then it just wasn't uh, going to happen. So, again, you know, adversity. It's not the first time we've had to be without a starter. Uh, so we were conditioned to do that. I think Aliyah and JB have played enough minutes that they could step into that role. And it was going to be about our guard play. And I think everybody contributed the way they could. And, and it's what, I mean, all teams deal with adversity. So we have to take our share, fair share of it. Faith, uh, senior nights can be tricky for players because of the emotions. Was it? Did it feel like a different game for you? Um, I don't even know. I can't even explain it. Like, it was a little weird in the beginning. Um, I'm not used to all that um, stuff going on. <laughs> but, um, I mean, when, once the ball went up, uh, it felt pretty normal. Um, why is everybody pointing? OK. Faith, it's when you made that kind of and one jumper there, <laughs> Kind of let out a little, a little uh, of a half grin. Was that kind of just, you know, it wasn't your best tonight? But the, it was it ended up being a, a really clutch shot. How, how kind of walk us through that one, and how how good did that make you feel? I guess. Um, I mean, I guess that game was just kind of like a lot of frustration going on, um, uh, a lot of like grittiness, and I don't know. It just felt good to just kind of knock that down. What's it mean to beat Carolina? You had never done it. Yeah, it feels really good. Um, Carolina's a great team, and um, we knew they were going to come in and try to, um, you know, steal this one from us. But, you know, we just wanted to come in and beat them. Caleb, for Sunday, how, I mean, obviously you guys weren't at full go the last time you played Tech. And, you know, that's a, that's a game you don't forget. So mm -hmm. how much will that be kind of motivating? Sunday going to Blacksburg? Um, that'd be a huge win ending the season, especially with the rivalry. Um, we have great momentum coming off of this game, so just have to continue to be aggressive and um, play through the fouls and continue to be um, UVA basketball and know that we can play with confidence and have each other's back. <coughs> Joanne, Andrew kind of touched on it, but um... Obviously, it's been a while since this program's beaten UNC. I know it's kind of a subplot, but how nice is it to kind of get that monkey off the program's back? Yeah. I mean, any anytime you have a good win against a quality opponent or a, an <coughs> opponent that, you know, you've had history with, it's always nice. Carolina's always had great teams. And, um, you know, my first year, I think we beat Maryland and, you know, we beat Louisville. So it's nice to kind of check these 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 teams off as we move forward and try and grow this team. And like I said, any good quality team team win is a great win for us. So um, it's, it's nice and it's great for the program.